Good afternoon, uh, we're back again, and this is another example question of parallel lines and their equations, yeah? And I'd like to say again, put this video on pause, try it out yourself, and then look at my workings and solutions. Yeah, I explain all of this in other videos, yeah? So put it on pause now, please. All right, well done, I hope you've tried that, and you were successful, and you're confident about your solution. Let's have a look. I have to create the line which is parallel to y equals minus x plus 4 and goes through point B to minus 5. Now what do I always do when I have to construct these equations eh, of lines? I write down the general equation um, y equals mx plus c which we call the gradient intercept form, eh, the gradient intercept form. Okay, now this is really nice because parallel lines are equally as steep, so their gradients are the same. So if it has to be parallel to this line, yeah, and this one is already written for you in gradient intercept form, now what is the gradient of this line? Now what is the coefficient of x? It's minus 1. So the gradient of this line, the line I'm constructing, uh, the equation of, also is minus 1. So minus 1x, uh, minus x plus c. Okay, their gradient is equal because they're parallel. It also goes through point B. How do I find, yeah, how, how do I find, uh, excuse me, the y-intercept? That's, uh, I find that by substituting that point in this equation, like I've explained in previous videos. So what is y? y now is minus 5, and that equals minus x, or minus 2, eh? be careful with those signs, that's minus x, minus 2, because x is 2, plus c. There we go. And then we uh, rearrange that to find C. So I got a plus it by 2. I had to get rid of the minus 2. That's only equal if I do it on both sides. Minus 5 plus 2. That's minus 3. So my y intercept is minus 3. So what does the equation look like, which is parallel to that line and goes through point B? That's going to be y equals minus x minus 3. Now I hope you have the same answer. If not, Check your workings. You probably made a small mistake, yeah, or perhaps a small thinking mistake. That's why we write down our workings, eh? so we can always check where we went wrong. Because it is absolutely fantastic to be wrong now. Yeah, well done. Make sure you learn from your mistakes. That's all I have to say. I'll see you later.